Hi there. How are you guys? Oh, what is this? Hmm, this is a banana, right? You like banana, guys? Banana, well, let's do this for you. Okay. Sorry for that. Okay, guys. Let me swallow. Done. <laughs> I am Akram Dewish, guys. Today, we're going to study this. We have the word or the verb eat and ate, right? Okay, so what did I do in the beginning? I ate a banana. Now, where is the banana? Done. The banana is here in my stomach, right? Very good. <clears throat> so this is eat, the verb eat. This is the present, all right? And eight, this is the past. Very good. So today we're talking about simple past or past simple. Very good. Listen, guys, we have two kinds of verbs or three kinds of the verb. So verb that we have eat, ate, different. So this one we call it irregular or walk, walked, all right? And we call it regular. It is the same, but we add ed, all right? This is regular. But this one, eat, we change it to eight. So this is irregular. Very good. Another one, do, did. So different. So this is what? Irregular. We have that kind that is uh, that remains the same. We don't, we don't change it. Cut, cut. Put, put. They're the same, all right? So we finished the three kinds of verbs. Now let's go back. So what did I do in the beginning of the video? I ate, sorry, a banana. So I finished the banana now, right? Very good. So this is the past. Done, past simple. So I ate a banana. How can I make this sentence negative? Or before I do that, what is the rule in here? So the rule here, I have here what? Subject, here, uh, past. I mean, past what? Verb. The verb must be in the past. And here, the object or complement. Okay? Very good. That is it. That's the rule. It's simple. All right. Now, how we make this sentence negative? I ate a banana. So let's make it a negative. I did, did, I did not eat or ate a banana. Which one is correct? So first of all, you need to understand that I say, I did, this is did, all right? So I did not eat or ate. Which one is correct? Eat or ate? I will tell you. Before we do that, how do we know in this sentence? How do we know this sentence is in the past? How? By what? By this verb. Okay? So I ate. So you say, oh, ate is past. So this is past. All right. Very good. Now let's talk about this. Let's forget this one. Forget it. Here. I did. Did. Is it present or past? Yes. It is what? Past. Because do present, did, past. So I did. So did here is the past. So we know now it is the past. So don't use another past verb. So here, I did not eat. Okay, this one wrong. Okay, I did not eat a banana. Very good. Okay, so as we said, did shows us past. So no need to use another verb in the past. Very good now. <clears throat> now, why did I, uh, why I wrote uh, did not? Because if I want to make them together, so in this case, I need to put them like this, didn't, right? What do we call this in English? Think about it, write it down in the comments, okay? It starts with C. I'll give you three letters, C-O-N. Find the others and write down in the comments, okay? Very good. Now let's go to the next. We have another way to make the sentence negative. How? By using the word never. But pay attention. Remember. You said remember what I said in here? Why we cannot use eight, not eat. Uh, like why we don't use eight? 
because did shows us what the past. So here, I never, never here is negative. Okay, but I want to ask you a question. Let's forget this one here. We delay. I never. What is the tense? You don't know, right? So in this case, you need to show me. I never eat a banana or I never ate a banana. Both are correct, I know, but I'm talking about this tense. So in this case, I never, what? Ate. We don't use this one. We are talking about this tense. But we can say, I never ate banana. That's true. Okay, or a banana. So here, I never ate a banana. So here, never is negative, but we don't know the tense. So if I want to show the tense that it is past, so I need to use what? Ate. So I never ate a banana. Do you, you understand the word? Um, uh, how we make it negative in the past? And what is the difference between this and this? Very good. Now let's go to the direct question. Okay, direct question we say did, then subject. Did you eat or ate a banana? The same idea I will ask you. Here you have did. What is the tense? Past. So don't use another past. Don't use this one. All right? So you will use this one. Did you eat a banana? You say, yes, I did. No, I did not. Is this one correct? Hmm? This one is wrong. Okay? This one is correct. No, I didn't. All right? So here you use it and we are going back to the same word. What is that word, guys? What is it? Find it and write it down in the comment. Okay? Very good. That's all about simple past. We use simple past, guys, in the past. Something finished, done. What is the banana? It's in my stomach, finished. This is the simple past. Oh, to complete everything in past simple, we still have one verb. Verb be. Verb be in the present time, like we have eat and ate. So verb be in present, we change it to be is, am, and are. I don't want to explain this, you know, is, we use it with she, he, and it, am with I, and are with you, they, and we. Very good. When we change it, when we change it to the past, we go to was and were. You know, we, we take both of both of these, all right, uh, for was and were for and are for were. Uh, the same with the pronouns, all right. Good. Okay, so let's take some examples. Here we go. So in general, guys, the the rule for past simple it is subject, past verb, and complement. You complete the sentence. Very good. Um, with with verb B, it's a little bit different. So, she was a student. She was young. She was here. What is this? For example, this is subject. This is the verb. This is um, an article. And this is what? A noun. All right? So, here, this is a noun. Remember, when you have was and were, or were, okay? You need after it a noun, or, what is this? She was young, old, tall, beautiful. So this is what? An adjective. All right. So we use a noun, maybe an adjective, or what? Adverb. So, here we go. So when you use was and were, you must use then a noun, adjective, or an adverb. Or you can put together. You say, she was a young student. It is fine to mix both. So you can write whatever. But if you use a verb, okay, here like, I ate a banana. You can use after it a noun only. Or you don't need to talk. I ate, um, not hungry, for example. Okay, uh, that's all about it. Uh, how we make it negative. Uh, simply guys, she was not. Okay, so when we put them together, you say she wasn't. All right, she wasn't like this. All right, very good. So uh, next, when you want to make it a question, it's easy, guys. You take this one here and this one here, and that's it. Like you say, was 
she at student. You say yes she was or no she wasn't. That's all about it guys. Thank you. I hope you enjoyed it. See you guys.